Honorable Chairman, uh, Secretary General of ITU, Excellencies and Delegations. I'm very honored to visit this beautiful city of Bucharest, Romania to attend the 21st ITU conference under the theme Connect and Unite. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to Secretary General Mr. Hualin Zhao and ITU officials for support and leadership in organizing this amazing event after two, three years of pandemic. On behalf of Mongolian government, I'm very grateful for the government of Romania and the National Authority for Management and Regulation in Communications for hosting this conference. I will use this opportunity to update you on Mongolia's latest digital development. The government of Mongolia has announced ICT sector as it's one of the leading sectors and aims to build a digital nation. In this context, several new legal instruments such as law and personal data protection, uh, public information, e-signature, and cybersecurity has, have been approved by the parliament last year and effective this year. We have also made necessary structural changes within the parliament as well as the government. For example, Standing Committee on Innovation and Digital Policy was established within the parliament in 2020 to create friendly legal environment for digital development in Mongolia. In addition to that, I'm very happy to inform you that the Mongolian government has established Ministry of Digital Development and Communications from January this year. In terms of achievement of digital governance, we introduced eMongolia platform in October 2020. So far, it has become the largest platform which includes over 2,000 government services and we provide services to 90% uh, of our adult population. And the system has delivered more than 16 million services to all Mongolians living in remote areas in the cities, and we are trying to ensure inclusion as much as possible in the nomads of Mongolia. Regarding the policy, a midterm policy document till 2027 called Digital Nation Strategy was approved by the government of Mongolia. In the background of all this, we are working towards the goal of becoming tech hub, next tech hub in Asia. We are working to create legal framework for granting e-residency for foreign residents, um, establishing a company registered in Mongolia, and also creating a legal framework to grant um, e-residency for foreign citizens and offer favorable tax regulations for them. With these few remarks, I would like to pledge Mongolian government's readiness and support to collaborate with the ITU and its member countries and to contribute to the implementation of ITU Connect 2030 agenda, as well as UN Sustainable Development Goals. In addition to that, uh, we must not um, leave anyone behind from digital development. In the world, we have a lot of inequalities. We have education inequalities, we have digital, uh, we have um, gender inequalities and income inequalities. And if we add digital inequality, I don't think we will be able to fill the gap of inequality in the future. So I would like to urge the countries here today to ensure digital inclusion in your own country as well as other countries. Thank you very much and good luck to you all.